Only three weeks to go until the 2023 Tournament of Roses Parade. Gail Anderson live in Irwindale with a look at the award-winning Phoenix Decorating Company and all the amazing floats that they're working on right now. Good morning to you, Gail. Good morning to you both. It's official. It's on. We're going to have a parade. We're here at the Phoenix Decorating Company, as you said, in Irwindale. We want to talk about a couple of things because they're an award winner. We never make time to talk about what they do for the royal court. You see uh, what they're working on, you know, the scaffolding and whatnot will be up around this. But um, let us show you what they built for the Tournament of Roses last year for the Rose Court. Here's video. Boy, it's gorgeous with the flowers and everything on it. It's the Queen's Float and the Royal Court. And of course, they're doing the wonderful hand wave. Uh, when the sunlight hits these floats, they're just magnificent. Now, here's the illustration for what they're building for the Queen and her court for 2023. Just to give you an idea, it will be gorgeous and wonderful. And this award-winning company built a phenomenal float for Mutual of Omaha, an award winner. If you missed it, look at it now. <laughs> With a salute to one of television's most beloved and longest running shows, RFD Mutual of Omaha presents Wild Kingdom. If you ask me, this was one of the best educational shows and entertaining shows in the history of TV. Marlon Perkins, just a legend. He hosted the show for 25 years. And there is the current host, Peter Gross, keeping an eye on a menagerie of beasts from the jungles, the frozen tundra, and the oceans. Beautiful. Well, take a look at the illustration uh, for the float they're building for Mutual of Omaha for 2023. Chris and Lynn Hoff, a Lofthouse family affair. It's good to see you. Congratulations on everything you've been through, pandemic and my craziness. What are your other challenges for 2023? Same as last year or different? A little different. I think uh, the biggest challenge is costs this year. I mean, everything is more expensive. More than uh, last year? More than last year. It's amazing. Uh, the supply chain really hasn't been as much of an issue as it was last year, but costs are up. And as uh, the diva of decorating, um, what are the challenges for you? Everything you see comes out of your, comes out of there. Uh, what are your challenges? Well, just to make sure that I get the uh, flowers I want and some of the dry materials because we're still doing decoration this Saturday. Mm -mm. So we've got a lot uh, of material that we still want to make sure we get. Is there anything we as viewers and, and the public can do to help you get, get going get, to make this happen? Well, definitely come down and volunteer uh, this Saturday, 9 to 5 all dry decoration, but then on December 26th through the 31st, we are rocking and rolling with flowers and everything. I've learned living here that after Christmas, oh no, it's no break, getting ready for New Year's, it's decorating. Here's information, uh, turn in the corner, that's what they're doing here at Phoenix Decorating. Their website is on your screen, phoenixdeco.com. Uh, for details about the floats they're building for 2023, as well as about decorating, uh, the colors are happening, no flowers already. More a little later this morning. We're having a parade, y'all. Back to you.